Y'all get ready. Yes, you get ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, happy Sunday. So I am on here to break down what went down last night. When I tell you Queen B did the damn thing, yesterday she made history. She was the first black woman, okay, to ever headline Coachella. And when I tell you Beyonce changed it from Coachella to Beachella, Beyonce took over the entire trending topic last night. It was crazy on social media. She did the damn thing. First of all, they live streamed her entire Coachella performance from YouTube. Folks were streaming it onto every social media platform. A lot of people were in the house. Rihanna was in the front row. You know what I'm saying? Beyonce proved to the world why we call her the queen bee and why no other female performer in this modern time can touch Queen Beyonce, point blank period. I don't care what you hate her say. She came to slay and she shut shit down yesterday, okay? I was so proud of her because we've watched Beyonce come a long way. You know what I mean? From being that little teeny bopper in Destiny's Child to going through the breakups and just the heartache and, you know, being picked apart to being the woman that she is today, to being a mother of three and a wife and everything she's been through. It was amazing to watch her growth. When I tell you from the time she came out, okay, dressed like a Nefertiti slash Cleopatra, she killed that shit. She was on stage with over 100 backup dancers. She had an entire marching band, okay? She paid homage to the HBCUs. On top of that, she brought out Destiny's Child. She brought out Jay-Z. And then her and her sister Solange, they killed that shit, okay? Beyonce let y'all know the queen is back. Fuck whoever is out here. I'm still that chick, okay? I'm going to go ahead and show you guys these videos, these clips from Beyonce's performance last night. Check this out and I'm going to come back with the rest of my commentary. <laughs> All right, honey, so y'all just seen those clips. I wish I could show y'all the whole thing, but y'all know I can't. This woman literally stood on stage and performed for two hours straight, 
okay? She performed 26 songs. And on top of that, like I said before, she bought out Destiny's Child, she bought out Jay-Z, she bought out her sister. She started with Crazy in Love and she ended with Love on Top, honey. She killed that damn shit and I'm just so proud of her. And I understand a lot of folks, you know, feel like Beyonce's not their cup of tea and you had the haters talking mess. But at the end of the day, I think she did the damn thing and I had to give her her props, okay? In my personal opinion, not only did she exemplify black girl magic, Beyonce didn't give a damn that it was Coachella, that it was primarily white people in the audience. She brought that black girl magic, okay? She had Malcolm X quote. She talked about Nina Simone. She did so much in her performance. It was crazy. She brought black culture to Coachella in a positive way. She brought that magic and she did the damn thing. I love the fact that she brought out young black girls and they were out there playing real instruments. You know what I'm saying? I also love the fact that all of her background dancers and the different people that she brought on stage with her were a wide variety of shades, okay? It wasn't just light-skinned women. It wasn't just dark-skinned women. It was every shade in between. To me, she really thought about this performance. She really thought about the imagery that she was trying to put out there. And Beyonce killed it. I don't give a damn what none of you haters say. I don't give a damn what y'all got to say about the queen, okay? She did the damn thing. She put on her black girl magic. You know what I'm saying? She represented beautifully. She danced her ass off. She did the damn thing for being a damn mother of three, okay? And as a mother myself, I'm damn proud of Beyonce. She killed that shit, okay? Yes, she killed that shit. I'm so proud of her. I thought that performance was dope, you know what I'm saying? And everybody is giving her props this morning. See that coach I see y'all play too damn much internet <laughs> And the 2018 Coachella will forever be known as Beachella after this, okay? So anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire beautiful situation concerning Queen Beyonce killing it and doing the damn thing last night at Coachella. When I tell you, baby girl took over the whole trending topics. And even this morning, it is Sunday. Her ass is still trending, okay? That's when you know you that bitch when you cause all that commotion, all that conversation, it's been damn near 24 hours and she is still trending on social media. Everybody's still hyped about her performance. Everybody's going back and watching the performances. Beyonce's that chick and y'all gotta give her credit when credit is due. So now let's sip on that. So anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. All right, deuces. I'm the only lady, I'm still the realest nigga in the room. I break the internet, top two and I ain't number two. My body, my eyes, my guy. I'm real, I'm a triple threat. Fuck it up and then leave. Come back, fuck it up and leave again. Top out of the in the night. Hey you guys, it's your girl T. Make sure to subscribe, like, and share my videos. You can also visit lovelytea.com to purchase any merchandise. Also, don't forget to click the boxes down below to watch any of my previous videos. Talk to y'all later. Deuces.